Hey, what's up guys? Second Crib over here back again with some more Destiny 2. Oh yeah, so you may be wondering what I'm doing in the Dreaming City. Well, I had an idea to do something fun and uh, it involves me using a controller. So, as you guys may know, Destiny was originally a console-only series, but uh, Bungie uh, made a PC port uh, for Destiny 2 and uh, I figured I might as well try uh, try out how the console players feel with Destiny 2. So, I'm not going to be I'm not going to be doing like anything I'm not going to be doing anything like crazy uh, on controller because uh, because like I'll be at a huge disadvantage. Yeah, I'll be at a huge disadvantage doing some activities on a controller like uh, like Gambit or uh, or the Crucible. So I'm only going to be doing PVE stuff. But uh, I figure the first thing I might want to uh, try out is uh, is trying to get some uh, uh, trying to get some bounties done for uh, for Petra in the Dreaming City, like uh, just getting Dreaming City stuff done. So let's see. All right, all right. So yeah, I just need to, I just need to like get used to playing with a controller again, because like I haven't played with a controller in Destiny since Destiny One. And to be fair, I did play Destiny One on Xbox, so I'm used to the Destiny One, uh, I'm used to the Destiny One like styles of controls. So, but it, it it's definitely going to be like weird because again, I haven't played Destiny One or I haven't played Destiny One. In a while, and I haven't played Destiny 2 on a controller at all. Like I don't, I don't have Destiny 2 on on console at all. I just have it on PC. So, like, I'm just not used to this. Hmm. All right. Definitely, it definitely still getting used to it, but. I will say, I will say, there's some, uh, there's some weapons on console that don't really work. Like, uh, I mean, uh, hand, ca uh, hand cannons seem to be much better on a uh, uh, hand cannons seem to be much better on uh, uh, on PC than they are on a uh, console. So, hmm. I mean, uh, I mean, it seems. Uh, I mean, auto rifles and pulse rifles, they, those those pretty much seem the same. So, all right, let's see. I just need to. I just need to like. I just need to like work on my aim. Wait. Hmm. I'm also. I also need to get used to. Uh, okay. I also need to get used to how weapons are. Uh, I need, also need to get used to how weapons work. Uh, and I also need to get used to the aim assist. Holy crap! I completely forgot about the aim assist. Hello. Nope. Bye. Okay. Hmm. Crap. All right. Let's see. There we go. Come on. I really... Uh, okay. I really just need to, like, get used to uh, how this works, because, like... My god. Switching from one controller layout to another is not fun sometimes. Alright. Okay. And this, and this is why I prefer, uh, this is why I prefer mouse and keyboard, because, like, it's so, it's so weird sometimes. Alright. Here we go. Again, I'm not doing anything like, uh, what? Again, I'm not doing anything, like, uh, completely, uh, uh like, it's something that needs me to use a keyboard and mouse, because, uh, because, like, I wouldn't, uh, I wouldn't know where to start, so. Alright, uh. Get out of here. Death proof is done. Nice. Okay. You know what? Screw you. Come on. There we go. There we go. Just need to take out the other taken wizard. There we go. Come on. All right. Now time. Uh. Okay. Okay. Yeah. Using chaos reach is not. Uh, using chaos reach is not as intuitive as it is on a. Uh, on PC, my God. Yeah, I need I need keyboard and mouse. It feels like I really do need keyboard and mouse, but uh, I'm commit I'm committing to I'm committing to doing this for uh, for a uh, for a video. So let's see. Ooh, tincture, nice. All right, let's see. Uh, let's see. I also so we need to do two we need to do two public events for a bounty. And I also need to do patrols. I forgot to pick up patrols while I was here. 
but I might as well just pick up two patrols while I'm uh, while I'm going to raise Sylvia. So. Let's do that. I'm pretty sure I wouldn't want to use my controller in a, in the Ascendant Challenge or maybe Blindwell either. Even even though well, even though Bungie did design these activities so that way uh, so that way they can be uh, they can be completed with a controller. But I still. Uh, I still don't want to do. I still don't want to do them with a controller because, like, some some activities are easier to do with a. Uh, uh, some activities are easy to do with a keyboard and mouse, in my opinion. But I mean, that's just me. So, let's see. We need to do. Uh, okay. Hmm. And it's all coming back to me, like <laughs> my experiences with playing the story mode in D1. Yeah. It's, it's so weird. There you are. Right. The taken are hoarding things that belong to us. It's not right. Don't worry. Working on it. I really need to go back and play D1 sometime. Just like, uh, just like try out, uh, try out the other classes in the, uh, uh, try out the other classes in in that game. Like, uh, like there's some, uh, there's, uh, there's some subclasses in. Uh, let's see. I haven't, I, I haven't really touched uh, Sunsinger in uh, in D1. So. Maybe uh, maybe I can go back to D1 and like try Sunsinger, or maybe uh, maybe I can go to D1 to try like uh, 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 try Hunters and Titans there, like uh, at like Gunslinger and Blade Dance, uh, Gunslinger back in D1, Blade Dancer, Defender, you know all those. Looks like the scorn are getting restless. Teach them how we relax. All right, let's do it. Luckily, it doesn't need to be heroic, so yeah. Alright, oh, crap. Right. Alright, let's see. Where are... okay. Okay, uh, okay, uh, hit firing is not as intuitive as you think it might be. My god. Alright, I... okay. It is, it is going to take me a while to get used to this. Oh my god. Hmm. Crap. Nope. Uh, uh, come on. There we go. All right. All right. And I got uh, the saboteur is poised to retreat. Hmm. Come on. There we go. All right. Uh. All right, I think I think if I remember correctly, I need to hold B in order to use, or I need to hold crouch in order to use my uh, in order to use my uh, class ability. So, the Baron. Oh boy. There's the machinist. But yeah, this is this is all coming back. My God. Okay, that works. Of course, of course we got blues. Should have figured. All right. Escapes with stolen riches. Huh. Never seen. Never seen that before. But let's see. Where is? Hmm. I need. I need taken. Hello. Where are all the taken? Usually I'm just used to like pressing a button and hey, my uh, my uh, uh, LMG is out. Hmm. All right, I need to get closer. Okay. Yeah, I, need, I really do need to get closer. Huh. All right. There we go. All right, let's see, what else we got? What other kinds of patrols do we have around here? Defeat enemies? All right, I can do that. That'll be easy to do with my. Uh, that'll be easy to do with my current setup. So, and for those of you asking, no, my uh, my mouse and keyboard are not broken. I'm just uh, I'm just I just decided to do this because why not? Like, I want I wanted to do some I wanted to do some kind of challenge in in Destiny 2 because like uh, it's like I mean I haven't played I haven't played on uh, con controller. So. Good. I'll feel better when you're out there mowing down tape. 
Don't worry, I got... Okay, you might... I would have been able to keep up that uh, feeding frenzy, or I would have been able to keep up that stack if I uh, if I had like uh, <laughs> probably would have been able to keep up that stack if I was aiming with a mouse. But you know, whatever. It's fine. It's fine. I did this myself. Okay. Right. Okay, Kirby. Alright, uh, any other enemies around here? Um. Alright. Okay. Oh boy! Huh. I'll just chaos reach you, because uh, I can. And luckily, canceling is the same way, so. Hmm. Yeah, I'm pretty. I'm pretty much always gonna be uh, fumbling with my controls with this game, so uh, just bear with me. So. Hmm. Okay, that works. Um, let's see. What do we have? To oh, okay. River Dawn boots. What do we have? Um, these are mobility focused. Ugh. These aren't. These aren't very good boots. Get rid of them. This is blue. This is also a blue. Alright, let's see. So, patrols, and I need to explore the Bay of Drowned Wishes. Remind me, is it this one? Uh, no, Bay of Drowned Wishes is in the mist. Alright. Might as well head over to. Oh, wait, I can, I can fast travel over there. Alright. I'm also not used to like pulling up the director by uh, by like holding uh, holding the back or no the view but it's the view button on a uh, on uh, Xbox One controller. So. Not used to that right now. <laughs> Let's see. Okay, so we got defeat enemies. I could do that. How you living? We need to make more than just a dent and take things as if we're gonna survive. Please help. Don't worry. Kirby the second with a controller is on the case. Yeah, uh, I uh, I will just say it's uh, it's easy it's not uh, it's not as easy as you think to switch between a uh, controller and uh, and mouse and keyboard like, especially when it comes to a first person shooter. Like, I mean I mean this is just me, but I pref I prefer using a keyboard and mouse for my first person shooters. Uh, some pe uh, some people may prefer otherwise, but I mean it's just my opinion. So. Let's see, uh, Lightmaker, huh? Hmm. I can definitely feel the aim assist. It's like it's so it's so odd sometimes. Let's see, uh, yeah, why not? Come on. Okay. Nice. Notorious Angram. Did I not get anything from that? Hmm. Oh, I forgot that. I didn't. I guess I didn't hold X over. Uh, let's see. All right. And then, uh, and then sparrow uh, sparrow writing is always weird uh, with the uh, with the controller as well. Cause like, wow. Could use a hand. Plenty of taken out here. Good for target practice. And hmm. All right. Might as well. Uh... My God. Okay. Hmm. All right. Yeah. I need. I... Hmm. Did I? Did I do that? Okay. There we go. This is this has got to be like the easiest day of uh, uh of like bounties in the dreaming city I have ever done. Okay, now that I'm thinking about it, how do I do that? How do I do that little in air dodge in a? How do I do that little in air dodge? So I, nope, I don't double tap. I don't double tap direction in the, on the control stick. Okay. How do I do that little in air dodge with a with my sparrow? Do I? Do I have to do? Uh, do I have to like press? Do I have to press in a direction on the D pad? 
I'm pretty sure that's it. I'm pretty sure I have to hold the direction in the D-pad, but... I, I mean... I mean, to be, fa to be fair... Uh, to be fair, I haven't I haven't really done SRL in D1 either, so yeah. I know, I know. Hate me. I haven't played D1 enough, but I mean, I did I did play through the story mode, so I I know what I know what kind of story we got, but I mean, still. All right. All right. There we go. Screams. Okay. There we go. That works. I have these. Okay. Those. Uh, those little mines. Those. Those are gonna get annoying. Yeah, it's it is still it is still like incredibly weird for me to be using a. <coughs> I'm, uh, I know I just keep saying it, but it's still incredibly weird for me to be using a a, a controller concept or a, like a, a control scheme that I'm just like I haven't used since uh, since console D one. So. Oh my god. We good? Okay. We're good. Not that I really needed that, but I mean, there we go. Hmm. Yeah. Okay. So that is the lost sector done. Well, let's get out of here. All right. This should do. Okay, let's go ahead and dismantle some blues that I may have gotten. Actually, may have is an understatement. I've actually got. So. Let's see, these can go. Hmm. Alright, and uh, we need to do Dark Monastery. So, I'll meet you back in Ray Sylvia. Alrighty, guys, we are back, and we are about to do a story mission with a controller. Now, I mean, I mean. Granted, I could have done, I could have tried like a heroic story mission with a controller, but I mean, I don't think, I don't think that's a good idea. All right. Hey, hot stuff. Your date with the scorn awaits. Thanks. All right. Hmm. Here we go. All right. Well, I'm, I'm gonna be fully prepared to wipe. Like, uh, I'm, I'm gonna be fully prepared to like, it just, it just completely eat it. But hmm. Raiders are still annoying. There's a reason I hate the scorn. But yeah. I've mentioned that quite enough. So back up. Alright, you know what? That'll do. Just do that. That's a really good opportunity for a grenade right there. I like it. Come on, man. There we go. Lurkers are still annoying. There we go. Alright, let's go ahead and uh, get my uh, chaos reach charged up. Okay. Yep. I'll just uh, go ahead and wipe uh, wipe out everything in front of me as I as I can. So. Okay. There we go. All right. Yep. Holding uh, holding crouch will uh, give me my class ability, which is uh, always uh, always nice. Okay. All 
Do you mind, Scorn? Come on. Hello? Okay. Okay. Let's just... Yeah, let's just get... Uh, Alright. Here we go. I guess if I, I guess if I wanted to, I could figure out how to do the uh, uh, how to do the air dodge. Okay, how do how do I do that? Hmm. Hmm. Yeah, I'm not sure. I'm not completely sure how to do that because, like, uh huh? Maybe it's the bumpers. I'm not sure. All right. Goodbye. Oh, crap. Go away. Alright. Go away, Screebs. No one likes you. No one likes the scorn, pretty much. There we go. Here we go. I might as well pull out my pull out my hammerhead. Uh, are you joking? Yeah, I'm going noticeably slower in uh, in killing these uh, killing these things. Are you kidding me? on night. There we go. <sighs> okay. Hmm. I was expecting it to go much smoother than it did. Yeah, I was expecting to slide into... Uh, I was expecting to slide into the Vandal and, uh, and melee it, but it didn't work that way for some dumb reason. Hello? Hmm. Wait, no. Ah. All right. Is this... Are you? Okay, that's not what I meant. Hmm. I will never get used to the fact that sprint is on uh, is by clicking the left stick. I will never get used to that. Like, I never even got used to that in D1. Alright. Hmm. There we go. Okay. Do you mind? Scorn. Do you mind not existing? Thank you. Okay, I don't really care about being damaged by that blight all that much, because, like, I mean, I was just. It wasn't even in there that long. There we go. Well done. Yeah, yeah. Well done, especially considering like I I don't use controllers. I don't use controllers for my FPSs. Mostly because like a lot of the FPSs that I have are on PC. So let's see. So I remember. Oh hi. So I remember there was a. Uh, I think there was. There were Arman, uh, There were Ahamkara bones. Up here, I believe. How do you get up there? I think the burst glide might be a uh, might be a good might be a good way to get up there. Hmm. Huh. Okay. There's absolutely no way I can make this. <laughs> nope. Bye. All right. Let's try that again. This time with the burst glide. Again, I'm not even sure if. It is it possible to get up there with a warlock? I, I know I know it's possible to get up there with a uh, with Stompy's hunters, but uh, but as for as for a warlock, I mean, might as well find out. 
Again, again, the Icarus glide, uh, the Icarus dash on the on the uh, top tree, uh, uh, top tree dawn blade is a good way to get over there. But I don't know how to activate that on a. Uh, I don't know how to activate that on a console or controller. Guess I might as well find out. Let's see. Uh, B B. Hmm. So basically, just shade step. Hmm. All right. Hmm. Hmm. Let's see. Let's see if I can make it now. Yes. Okay, burst glide. That's how you get over there. That's how you get over there with a warlock. You need you need burst glide. Don't fall. Okay. It's a good thing we got mantle. Like uh kind of wish uh, I kind of wish uh, I'm kind of wish like D1 had mantle in the first place, but I mean you know, whatever. Ex nah. Extasiate 3. Hmm. Alright then. Okay, there's got to be a way to get back over there, no problem. Maybe by jumping off that pyre right there? Hmm. Let's see. Probably it. It'd be d it would be dumb if there was no way back over, but I mean... Yeah. I mean, uh, Bungie, uh, Bungie should have, like... Uh, I, know, uh, I know Bungie could have, like... Uh, couldn't have, like, made it impossible to get back, so. Alright. Alright. There we go. Come on. Really? This is a very durable Let's crystal. Go. Okay, and there's no music playing. Should have figured. I mean, to be to be fair, I did fall off the edge twice in the ascendant realm. So there we go. I captured video again. I'll send it on to Petra. No problem. Perfect. So just did and just did the uh, just did the story mission with uh, with my with a controller. So fun. Uh, okay, this is a not a good Badlander. That's a really bad Badlander. Oh, you gave me the Sparrow. Nice. Okay, people are going to be mad. <laughs> people are going to be so mad that I got the Sparrow. Because, <laughs> like, to be honest, the Sparrow... The Sparrow is... It pretty much doesn't exist for a lot of people. I think... You know, I might want to try. I might want to try Shattered Throne. I might want to try Shattered Throne this week, see if I can get the ship. And then after that, uh, then after that, I'm the only items I'm missing for the uh, for the Curse Breaker title is uh, the only item that I'm missing is Horror's Lease from uh, uh, from the uh, the Corrupted Nightfall. But yeah. Alrighty, guys. I think that'll do it for this episode of Destiny 2. I hope you guys enjoyed me using a controller again for the first time since Destiny One. Uh, yeah, just playing Destiny with a controller for the first time since Destiny 1. Anyway, stay tuned next time for maybe some Gambit, Gambit Prime, Reckoning, something, who knows. Thanks for watching, guys, and I'll see you next time. Later!